Howdy folks, today I'm going to be manufacturing and testing the 9mm pistol. Okay, so first we need to look at what it requires. 10 low quality metal. Thankfully I've got enough to do that. So... Doesn't take long to make. Although it's quite heavy on the metal fragments, I mean... That is quite steep, but... What do you expect? We're building a semi-automatic pistol in a shack with a stone furnace. I mean, a bit crazy. Okay. Uh, there we go. Takes a minute. Okay, as you see, I'm quite fond of the nomad uh, way of living. I rarely have... Um, a proper shelter long term because I'd collect as much wood and stone as I go and rebuild it every night and I've usually got more than enough wood to do it I mean I've been burning this thing all night and I've got this going as well as you can see not exactly short on resources Because I'll tell you what, it's a kick in the balls when you wake up the next morning. You log out, you wake up uh, tomorrow morning or at, you go on it after work or whatever. And you're dead and you've been burgled. you lost lost everything. Whereas little shacks like this, they tend not to draw attention. Most people think there's nothing in them. And in this case, they're, they're correct. So, there we go, it's built. Okay, there we go. Uh, modelled after the Beretta 92. Oh, that's quite nice. Okay, you can see the slots down the bottom. Now I happen to have a flashlight mod. I'm going to turn it off for now. But I also have the ability to make a silencer, which will be quite useful. So, if I can find it, there we go. Need eight more low quality metal, okay. I could probably do taking this flashlight off to be honest. Never mind. I'll keep it for now. Where's the low quality metal? There we go, need eight. Typical. It's okay. I've got some cooking. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the flashlights on this because although it does light up the enemy, it also lights up you. You can see it. The enemy can see you for miles away, so just be aware of that. Okay, need one more metal. Crikey, this is labour intensive, isn't it? Speed things up a little bit. Okay, while I'm waiting for that, I shall make some more ammunition. Gunpowder, there we go. I think I know everything is, everything is by now, I've played it enough. And 
nine millimeter ammo. Okay, almost done. There you go. God damn it, covers up the sights. But as you can hear, much quieter. It's not going to give, the, give me away to bandits or anything. So, that's good. Very useful. I highly recommend putting a sight on anything that can take them. Okay, I'm going to wait until morning. We're almost there. Then I'm going to go look for things to shoot. So, see you in a few minutes. Okay, I found a zombie to attack. Or well, he found me rather. Okay, two shots will drop him. Okay, he took me by surprise really. Um, I was just wandering around trying to get my bearings. And he came out of nowhere. Okay, this is going to be the challenge. I think that's a black zombie. Um... Okay, it's starting to attachment, uh, but it's quite difficult to aim. You've pretty much got to guess. Two shots will drop in. Now, I'm not usually uh, a big fan of scientists in game. Uh, it, in this game, sorry. Um, the reason I'm using it now is because I want to get used to using it because it doesn't alert bandits to your location. Okay, it's not too bad at close range. Yeah, not too bad. I'm not going to say it's good. Oh, Kevlar pants, awesome. Okay. As you can see, the dark zombies take a lot of damage, but worth it, you can get some good stuff out of them. Ah, fuck, I'm surrounded. Okay, the best thing to do is pick them off individually. Good. Okay. 
Okay, I need to get out of this radiation zone really. Okay. Okay, as you can see, it's quite a useful weapon when you don't want to alert people to your location. Um, it'd be much, much better for aiming if I never had the silencer. But I think at the moment the silencer's quite a bonus. Hmm. I'm not going to bother taking him on. Yeah. Okay, it's quite a bad place to be for zombies, so I'm going to piss off out of it. Oh, hello. What's that? Dead body to molest. And absolute shite, as expected. Okay, there we have it. That is... Um, the Beretta 9mm with silencer and flashlight. Actually, flashlight, F to activate. Not much good in the data, but not much good in night time either. As I said um, before, this might give you a few metres of visibility, but someone will see this miles away. And if there's bandits about and they want your stuff, if they know you've got a flashlight, it means you've got a decent weapon and they want it. So, my advice is don't bother. And uh, there we go. Nice little weapon. Uh, very, very good for farming zombies. As long as there's not too many of them. Uh, you need to work on your accuracy by just practice, really. Cause you, obviously, you can't look down the iron sight properly with that sensor in place. Uh, but this can be overcome by fitting a laser to it, which I can't make at the moment. If you put the laser to it, it lets you aim much, much e better and much more accurate. You get some nice headshots with it. And there we go. That's it. Thanks for watching. Join me next time. Please remember to subscribe.